yeah, it's great. It's a really good accomplishment. Over the last three seasons, we've only lost one regular season match, which is just a testament to our consistency and work ethic and honestly mental toughness of this group. Uh, really proud of them. It's not an easy conference to win. Um, it's a grind, you know, from a travel perspective sometimes, as well as just good volleyball. And I thought the conference as a whole was a little up this year. So i uh, really proud of the accomplishment and the consistency of this group. Yeah, I, w I mean, I think they could be a dangerous team. I was glad that we managed it and didn't force it to even extended points in a set and were able to take care of business when we needed to. But offensively, we're a good matchup for them. Um, and defensively, they took advantage of some things that some of that we slowed throughout the course of the night and some that still scored by the end of the night. So we'll look at, you know, sharpening up those pieces of our game as well. Yeah, you know, even last night with all of our family here, it's just, it's a little bit moving, honestly, to see the number of people that show up for MSU Denver Volleyball on a consistent basis. And we have such a great group of parents and, and family and support systems, and their daughters are reflections of that. And so we see it in the senior class tonight. Uh, those four are a huge piece of what we do, you know, and, and have, like I've said before, cemented the culture of MSU Denver Volleyball. Uh, so, you know, we're going to miss them tremendously, but we're excited that we still get some time to make a run with them. It's really exciting. It's I, That's just a hard work over a long period of time. It's not just one good weekend. It's not, yeah, just not just one good weekend. It's like months of grinding and putting in the work, and it pays off. It's definitely kept us on our toes more, which I think is honestly a good thing. I mean, sometimes we can get into this mundane, like, routine, and this one has not been that. So it's exposed weaknesses earlier than we have in the past, so that's been really good, and we've been able to work through things as a team from, like, a unity mental standpoint to actually the technical parts of volleyball. So it's been good. I mean, it's exciting because we get to come back and play here all through next week, not just one game. So it's exciting to bring it back for our fans to get their support as well. And then it also shows like the hard work because this conference is super competitive. So you have to show up for every game. And so for us to get that, it's super exciting. I mean, it's always fun. I'm, maybe it's because I'm biased, but I like blocks more than kills. So, and it's just super fun to turn around and cheer with your team because everybody has your back, whether you're on the court or on the bench, everybody's hyped over a block. And so it's fun to see us show out for our last regular season game. It's always rewarding. You know, I think that's just a testament to like the consistency that we have as a program, but like maintain, like winning's not easy. And so I think the cool part has seen how this journey, even though the end result at this point in the season is the same, this journey has been completely different than any season we've had in the past. So I think we realized that serve and pass was the name of the game. Um, I think we executed that well, especially in the second and third set. And that's what really put a stop to him was the difference maker most of this match. Um, we want to emphasize more um, defensive plays, especially when we do reach a point where we are getting ahead of teams a little bit, that we have to maintain that defensive effort because that, those are the points that build momentum and really win big things that we want. Um, it's just really exciting. I mean, it's this is a really tough conference. I mean, any team, as we saw a lot this season, can win or take sets off of a lot of people. And so it just shows just like, the amount of just talent that we have and the amount of passion that we have and how we put it out on the court. Yeah, it's it's always good because we know that that's our strength and that's how we, that's just the process of being able to shut other teams down. And so it's always really good to be able to get those super good blocking nights. Um, I mean, it's just like any other time, you know, but yeah, we're just, I mean, postseason is super exciting, so it's the time that we just let our passion show and just like leave everything out there on the court. And so that's what's super exciting about postseason is that we all just get to go out there and continue to do what we love. And yeah, we just keep being us and keep doing what we've been doing.